Hello everyone, the trees here now welcome you to this new video. Last time on Library of Runa, we have finished up the lower floors. And this time it is time for the, for the middle ones. For this I have made some builds, and most of them are probably not good for the floors I made them for. Because this time um yeah. This time I made the builds alone. Not with you guys. So, I have copied over many builds from the other pages, but yeah, this is what we go with. We have uh, Olivier, uh, PT, and Carlo as our main pages here, as well as Bambuetta, Kim, and Don Juan. So, this is technically our strongest individual pages, all orange pages too, on Tiferef's floor. Because I have no idea who's going to go here. I I would assume Oswald because he brings animals and stuff and we are natural sciences, but like same logic would apply to, to Tanya being a wolf, so however Tanya fits more into Gebra with uh, brute, brute strength type. Gebra again with a very um, classic thing. Mio's prowess, health holder, mind holder and insurance benefits. We are forcing her into one side attacks anyway with counters and I think it works with the, uh, where is it? I think it works for Retaliate. I'm not entirely sure. We'll see here. Um, we got Charles Page on here, unchanged. I didn't put the other passive of, uh, uh, Philip on here because I don't self burn that much. Uh, then we've got London on Esther's page, same page we used on the last one. Reinhardt of a funny Eugen and Cloyer on one of the copy paste uh, guns. Then on Chess's floor, I went all out. I I made Mirene. I actually built a yarn page, and I'm not sure about this at all. But it's just it's just a um, somewhat hopefully decent ish uh, singleton. Try to build up to seven light for the sword blade and just let it rip. Uh, Yuri is on Nikolai's page. I supplemented... Oh god, I got a message on somewhere. Yeah. Yeah. Supplemented by uh, Brayman's passives, which are both pretty good, both pretty supportive, so I put it on the designated support page as, and it should hopefully help this pulsal out. Got one copy paste gun here and arena. So I did let go of Yay and the, uh, the smoke build because I still cannot seem to figure out how to play smoke properly. It always feels weird. Uh, but yeah. For today, I want to try and figure out whether we can or cannot actually be Tiff's uh, floor. Red told me that uh, the middle floors are basically free. Well, he literally said, well, middle layer is free. So let's see if he was right or if I embarrass myself. Let's go. Sure enough, this is Oswald and he only has two ads, so that's actually pretty sad. Takes half as much stagger damage from attacks of deflects so of a second scene uses a common page with super... It stupefies the librarian with the highest HP. Stupefaction, so it's basically uh, making them unusable. Okay, he has a clown deck. That's that's not unexpected. At the start of a scene, give one strength, one endurance, and free protection to the stupefied librarian. Oh, that's nice. When the librarian stagger takes 60 stagger damage at the end of the scene, after librarians are free from super faction two times, uses the mass effect of a follow ma mass attack on the following scene and wall fabric, which we already know. Hmm. Also he has speed two. I didn't check whether the other Brayman guys had speed two. Sure enough, they have speed three. So that's probably just for this fight, and then after this fight it's speed three. Then we got the knife guy, which is just a lot of stuff. And the mermaid guy, which we already fought once. 
Okay, let's just go in.
무섭기만 하다구요 하지만 기대한다는 건그 사람을 믿는 거야 넌 고작 기대에 부응하지 못하는 걸 두려워하며 도망칠 뿐이잖아 <웃음> 글쎄요 행복을 바라는 것이 죄랍니까? 모두가 웃는 세상을 바라는 게 나쁜 건가요? 음. 뭐, 서로가 공연에서 보여주고 싶은 웃음은 다른 법이지요 그쪽도 자신이 원하는 웃음의 형태를 바라고 공연을 할 뿐이잖아요 다른 광대를 웃기기 위해 공연을 펼쳐봅시다 인사는 이쯤 하고 슬슬 혀위에서 놀아볼까요? <웃음> 그래 네 말을 빌리면 서로 자신이 서 있는 무대를 지켜야 하는 거겠지 뭐해 Oh, different music. Interesting. Okay, let's see if we can get this done. Actually, if you snake slid on a different one and put drop a sword there, we cannot lose any clash. We should be able to block with this with just draw the sword. Your Celestial Spear there. Uh, what's that? Let's get some strength. Doesn't really matter where we go with that. Actually, it does somewhat matter. Do Bayo combat here? That will probably not survive. Summer pro procuration here. Dagger press here. Oh, you started blood, eh? Well, Oswald doesn't really take stagger damage anyway. Let's use that on the two. And giga gig on this one. No, uh, something that has a fossil die on it. Let's go! As I said, it literally cannot miss. Okay, that goes pretty well so far. Hmm. Why not? It's best on Kim because Kim will never lose a clash. Oof, mass attack. Is that an individual automation? It's individual. Ew. This is 6 to 8. Oof.
Okay. You may also Gale kick here. There's no real reason for you to move. I wanted that one. Hmm. In that case, why not gun him? Because that will definitely stagger. Let's go. Close high roll. Yep, staggered. Okay, knife will die next turn at the latest. That's what stupid fighters say. Hey? That's not good. Okay, you gun your way out of there. Hmm. I say we wait. We have true trigger information. We really did not get the best card in this build, eh? Let's go in. Really? By one? I will never deal max value, but I can always try.
Restore a light just so we can get, have it gone. She's only staggered from one more scene. Let's go. Oh, yeah. What am I supposed to do if he rolled twelve, eh? Intemperance. Intemperance is really good. That's really bad. That's okay. It's good on you because your first die will always win. Targets all other characters, but I don't want. Uh. Ooh. I'll take the sword. Really the same person again? Do we have? Oh, uh, with one strength, that's not enough, but we can go here. You can go there and create more ammo if you want to. You have to use Econ this time. Best case scenario, you use Econ twice. Okay, this is supposed to go here, right? Yeah. This is supposed to go there. Okay. And you just do nothing. Jesus, we're doing a lot of damage. Considering the wall of fabric is in effect, we are dealing a ton of damage. And two of his dice are broken, which is great. Okay, now that's a reason to use the light one.
You'll be unable to win that flash. Let's be real. Unfortunately, this is a very strong slash card. Yeah, use that here. Use that. Actually, don't use that anywhere. This is just about knowing when to attack who. This clone has literally 13 health. What's he gonna do? Well, not getting damaged by focus fire, that's what. Try to get some burn on him. You counter that. And you go here. A bet should be more than enough. Yep, he's dead. Carlo, you did your job. Victory! That was indeed very free. Wow. I can't believe how free this was myself. Suppose the biggest difficulty about this is if you actually... Yeah, the biggest difficulty about this is if you bring two strong pages, then if he steals one of you guys, that could backfire a lot. I was, I was originally trying to bring Jan here, but I'm glad I didn't. But then again, you could probably, yeah, you could probably just uh, redirect who's gonna get stolen. Yeah, that was a very easy reception, not gonna lie. Huh. So far, Philip remains the hardest. And this is also the shortest, though I suppose Greta would have been shorter if I was able to focus more. Oh, well, that's all I've got time for for this episode. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And if you if you did, I hope I see you guys again in the next episode. Yep, that's as easy as it is. Until then, I wish you guys a wonderful, wonderful, wonderful time. And I hope to see you again. Bye. Bye. Find the right picture, man. Something gets wrong.
everyone, it's Patrice here and I welcome you to another episode. Hello everyone, it's Catrice here and I welcome you to this new 